Hey everybody here, it's Jason again from Akintech along with AKA Curious and today we probably have something different for you and that is, what is it? Linux. And we are going to talk about the difference between yep. KDE and GNOME. And for my opinion, I think KDE well, is better than GNOME. No offense to those out there. Okay. Just to get this, just to get this straight, they are all X window managers and KDE is more like Windows and GNOME is more like Linux. And if you don't know what X window manager is, it's a windowing system mainly used in like Unix like operating systems like Linux, Lunix, and that other stuff. Well, what and are the graphics? There's like so stuff? many different types of It's graphical. Yeah, that's what that's what I mean, uh X window manager is. KDE. Yeah, that's what that's what the X window manager is. Yeah, but I think GNOME yeah, is Yeah, those are X window man. Yes, but you're talking about it's GNOME, plain. aren't you? Because GNOME is too basic. KDE yeah. is... Yeah, GNOME. Okay, what about GNOME? Yeah, GNOME is basic, but it's... If it gives you the more Linux and Unix-like feeling. Like okay, the, okay, okay. Look at Apple. All right, let's see what like the chat room has to say. I have Elite here. And he says KDE has more graphical tools that are helpful to new users. Yep, he also says KDE also offers you the option to change your settings to be a certain style, Mac style or Windows style. Of course, love that. For example, that will affect the way Windows and keyboard shortcuts behave. Like you can use your Windows keyboard to do this and that. I found themes much easier to install in GNOME. Um, okay, yeah. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a KDE person, but I guess, yeah, GNOME's got its good things too. It's genuine but, it's unique but I also use different I use other uh, popular uh, X Windows managers like Fluxbox, Kwin, Metacity and all those other ones you know um, Linux can't be scary CM CM's just commenting he's saying that Linux scares me you can get a live CD it's actually getting easier and easier in fact one thing it's free so you don't have to worry about downloading that hacked software or going paying hundreds and hundreds of dollars I mean Linux has got everything um, but, you know... But, yo... <laughs> yes. But there's also other types of, uh, you know, Barrel and Compass and Compass Fusion I and play with Barrel. and XFW... Uh, I can't remember. I was told that Barrel yeah, Barrel's is, up, uh, out of is no more. Right now. Yeah, apparently it's, it's with Comp Fusion or something. Uh, Compass. Compass Fusion. Oh, I so yeah. want to play with that. That'd be so Compass awesome. You can, and like, Barrel fuse into one to make Compass Fusion. If you take okay, for those out there watching, it, you if if you think of the way the Mac effects are, and then you look at the Flip 3D in Windows Vista, um, Barrel or Comp Fusion just totally crushes them. Like just say forget it. Like when it comes to Barrel or Comp Fusion, whatever, same thing now I guess. You're you're totally just like wow, like that is so cool. That's awesome. I haven't even gotten that far to run that version yet in Linux, yet. I'm gonna eventually play with it when I get the time and so. Yes, but. So yeah. Yes, sir. Yeah, but there's so many. Um, those are called composite uh, Windows managers, and Barrel and Compass fuse together to make Comp Compass Fusion, which is uh, the combination of both projects. Mhm. Mm What's your favorite version and of Linux? I happen to like Debian. Um. I like them. Um, I like a lot. I like Dam. No, Dam Small is okay. Ubuntu, yeah, Ubuntu Studio. Ubuntu's probably got to the top. Sa Sabian, Yellow Dog Linux. Don't forget Red Hat. Let's see, Slack was okay. What else is okay? Oh yeah, OpenSUSE is okay. It uses KDE. Mm -hmm. Um, Yellow Dog, I said Fedora Core is okay. Sabian is awesome. Sa I can't pronounce it. Sabian, Sabian, same good. thing. Just like um, Ubuntu, Ubuntu. Yeah. Damn small. Anything, any type of Linux or Unix distributions are fine with me. Well, just but remember. I never use Debian a lot. I only use it like a few times. Mm -hmm. Just remember that. And if, um. If, um <laughs> sorry, there's a delay within Ventrilo. Just remember that. Their Linux is based off Unix, and so is Mac. So, um, here's my question for Fierce, since he seems to be the Linux lover, and here, <laughs> no offense. Um, do you think Linux is? And my audio over? is not going with my video. 
No, yeah, there's yeah. seems to be delay in your stream. It, yes, there is. Big delay. Yeah, it's very odd. So what do you think? Do you think Lynx is going to take over Mac and PC or L Windows or what? Um, not Mac, because Mac is based on Unix, and but it might take out Windows, because I don't really like Windows that much anymore, as it used to. Mm -hmm. And that's why I have, well, my, you might not see this, but you might see this on my stream, and <laughs> on the video. I'm, hol yeah, right there. Two stickers. I'm holding a bunch what of a stickers, guy. as you can see. That's crazy, man. You can always count on AKA Furious. And <laughs> He's quite the guy. Well, if you have any questions and not or going comments. Away. Yes, it's gonna stay here for a while. Anyways, that's what we have basically to bring you here is a little uh That's all we know, have for today. Yeah, little uh AKA Furious time with his beautiful Linux as he's always saying, I like Linux. We all know it's it's pretty good to get into. I got into it for a while. I ran it as a server for a year, and it was just absolutely phenomenal, even on an older computer. But if you have any questions or anything, feel free to email us, info at macintech.net, M-C-I-N-T-E-C. -E you may also visit our website, macintech.net. You can go to live.macintech.net and join us on our live chat. We are on the Wild Ride IRC network. Our If you have a client, our channel is pound macintech, M-C-I-N-T-E-C. And, you know, just let us know what you're interested in. And we are communications and technology. It doesn't have to be just about computers. It can be about anything. And tonight we thought we'd do a show because there's a little debate going on KDE and GNOME, which is part of Linux. And I don't, I feel that that Linux isn't talked about as much. So stop by any time. And thanks for watching. And we'll chat at you later.